have what? a feeling it's it's not that they don't want to be a part of it. Uh, I think it's just they're more in the business of prayer than politics. Okay. Even though this is obviously a, a prayer thing that you guys do. You realize this isn't politics. Right. Yeah. I know, but, you know, it yeah, just depends. So, if if they want to do their own thing outside of Planned Parenthood, that's fine. Well, my understanding that this is the, the parking lot is private property, but you cannot stand here. This is this is your property. That little inside right there is private property. You can't stand in there, so you can stay on the Side sidewalk. Right. Yeah. This isn't your property yeah. where you're standing. No, he says it's private property. No, it's not. Yes, it is. This is a public sidewalk. Yeah. This is a, is the people have to walk through here. You, you really should care more about your pre-born neighbors than where we're standing, honestly. Hey, brother Ben. Yes. Does this bother you that this is what yeah, we? If you, I know I call honestly, if you guys could just do me a personal favor and just leave the driveway area clear, and you can. Oh, he's got to come in here. Yeah, know, we understand so that. We'll let we'll him drive in. Yeah, well, well, we're not going to block anybody. Yeah. But you really should be more concerned about what's happening to your pre-born neighbors oh, than where we're standing. What do you though? Do you? Are you taking action to love your neighbor as yourself to rescue them from being murdered? They were murdered in Milwaukee yesterday. Mm -hmm. Was anybody from the church out there? I didn't see anybody out there. I'm not, I'm not completely sure if um, being present at an event uh, is necessarily required or necessary to stand against evil. Well, not just an event, but where your neighbors are being mass murdered, do you know when and where? 1428 North Farwell Avenue, Affiliated Medical Services in Milwaukee. That's where they were murdered yesterday. And you can look it up in just a, in just a few seconds. Yeah. And Planned Parenthood in, in Milwaukee on Water Street. And so we know when and where they're being mass murdered. And yet we take, we take no action. That's, that's disobedience to the Lord. When he says, love the Lord your God, love your neighbor as yourself. In Proverbs, it, he says, deliver those who are being taken away to death. Hold back those who are staggering to the slaughter. That's what we need to do. Not, not just say, well, that's not my calling, or I'm just going to pray about that. No, it says, then say, pray about those being led away to death. Rescue those being led away to death. And most, Christ most professing Christians aren't doing that. They're living in disobedience. And they see these images. It doesn't bother them at all. Does it bother you that this is what happens to children in our culture? Happened to children in Milwaukee yesterday, right? See this? Does that bother you? Of course it bothers me. Does it bother you enough to take action? To go out to go out to where they're being murdered. I have to I have to make sure that I'm going to things uh, how do I describe this? Because these, these are your most needy, helpless, innocent, defenseless neighbors. I mean, this, this country is all worked up right now about shootings of people outside the womb. But, they could, but people couldn't care less about mass murder inside the womb. We're, we're human rights hypocrites. We care about born people being murdered, but not pre-born people being mass murdered. Well, this country, okay. this country is full of tens of millions of professing Christians and almost none of them act like children being mass murdered. Almost none of them go out to the, the, the murder mills, the abortion mills, or they're being slaughtered. Yeah, I think, I think I'm ready. Um, well, consider... I have, I have your stuff. Um, consider I'm your... Gladly consider... I can't, God. I can't make a commitment right now. And that's just how it is. Um, but I have listened to you. I have your pamphlets. Um, as you as you go on your way, consider not do, not what you want to do, but what your neighbors need of you. Oh, sure. Yeah. 
we a lot of us we want to do our own thing we want to do what feels good but we do that in disregard of what our neighbors need of us sure. so consider what do your neighbors need of you okay. they need your action thank you yes sir thank you for talking with us